Hey everyone, it's Nolan with Strike Point Sports. Today is Wednesday, June 2nd, and welcome back to another edition of Video Plays with Strike Point Sports. Hope everybody's having a good Wednesday out there. Happy Wednesday! Happy Wednesday. Before we get into the free play, don't forget you can find out everything you need to know about us here at Strike Point Sports at www.docsports.com. Again, www.docsports.com. You can also follow us on Twitter at SPS Doc Sports, and you can follow us on Instagram. All you have to do is go to that search button, click it, and click Strike Point Sports. So you can find all of our free plays and other exciting news about Doc Sports both on Instagram and Twitter. And follow us on the Doc Sports YouTube page where you get myself from Strike Point Sports and all the other great handicappers at Doc Sports. Also, don't forget the link below. Click it for all you new members. Free $60 to use as you so choose. It is our 50-year anniversary in the biz, Doc Sports, one of the best in the biz. We're giving out a free $60 to celebrate our 50-year anniversary to use as you so choose. Daily sports packages across the board are about $30, so you could get a couple of those or kick in a little extra and get a week's worth of picks. Use it at Strike Point Sports because we have you covered in the WNBA, NBA, Major League Baseball, hockey, golf, and soon-to-be football just around the corner as the summer gets rocking and rolling. Had a good night last night with our free plays. We gave you Brooklyn last night. They won easy. And then for those of you that listened to the entire video, we threw in Phoenix at the end as well. And that was an easy cover. Unfortunately, our rated play in the NBA did not hit. We liked the over there. Phoenix did exactly what we thought they would do. We thought they would push the tempo. They scored 115 points. But unfortunately for us and for anybody that followed our rated play, the Los Angeles Lakers didn't come to play, and actually LeBron James walks off the court at the end of the game. That's a whole other story altogether, and the Lakers only mustered 85 points. So we fell short of that posted total by about seven, seven and a half, eight points. And so that stunk for us. Uh, you know, like we've talked about before, we, we bet our own plays, and we didn't win that one, but we did hit the Nets and Phoenix to have a winning day overall with our free plays. Just didn't hit that rated play. But we're back today with a nice rated play in the Eastern Conference, and I have a free play for you right now we like let me make sure i get this rotation number yes number 536 the utah jazz minus nine and a half over the memphis grizzlies it goes off about 9 30 tonight this series is over this series is over everybody was all about the memphis grizzlies and they've had an awesome year they really have. They've had a great year john moran is giving grizzlies fans something to be excited about for the future but look during the regular regular season the jazz were the best team in the NBA. They just ran roughshod for a while, just destroying teams. Then suddenly they didn't play very well, especially when Donovan Mitchell got hurt, and everybody just jumped off the Jazz bandwagon. Not really sure why that happened. People were all about the Memphis Grizzlies to win one or two games in this series. They did. You know, they have pushed Utah a little bit, but since Donovan Mitchell's been back, this series has been over. The Jazz are averaging almost 128 points a game with Mitchell back in the lineup, and tonight's going to be no different. We do not see them having any issues of winning this game by double figures. The Jazz are 5-1 and one against the spread in their last six games overall. They're 11 and four in their last 13, 15, excuse me, 15 home games versus a team with a winning road record. They're 23 and 11 in their last 34 home games as a favorite, as a home favorite. So the Jazz know how to win. And when they're at home, they're not going to have any issues taking down the Memphis Grizzlies. They're just not. Don't overthink this one. The Grizzlies have been a darling, but if you really think about it, they're one and six against the spread in their last seven games overall, and they're one and four against the spread in their last five games as an underdog. So don't buy into this one too much. Just don't do it. Take the Utah Jazz number again. Yep, got to check it. Want to make sure everything is correct. Number 536 over the Memphis Grizzlies, minus nine and a half. It's probably going to go up. Doesn't matter. We would lay all the way up to 12 in this game. So take number 536, the Utah Jazz, minus 9.5 over the Memphis Grizzlies tonight at 9.30. And with all that being said, best of luck.